Hi there, just want to talk to you about installing the 7 kilowatt units, okay, some things we'd like you to do. Obviously, have a look at it before it leaves the office if it's the first time you've done it. Take the lid off, have a look at where the inputs are, a little diagram on the side that'll show you all that kind of stuff. Uh, just make sure you're comfortable with it, don't wait till you get to the site to do that and look at it for the first time. But really importantly, um, we need to limit a couple of bits on this. So if you're doing this with a single stack of batteries, okay, not using a combiner box, we need you to put those batteries online and allow us to do a firmware upgrade on those batteries before you go, even go up to the site. Just do it in the office. You can put your Greenlinx batteries that you're going to use with this installation, put them on the floor, put the dongles in, put them all online and allow us to do a firmware upgrade. What that firmware upgrade is going to do is it's going to make sure that when they're joined in a stack of anything more than, uh, well, from one unit onwards actually, that they'll never, as a batch, discharge more than 100 amps really helpful safety feature okay um, and then what we're also going to ask you to do without fail is never connect the batteries up into up onto this unit until you've put this unit online and allowed us to assist you by going into the background of this unit and also setting the discharge to 100 amps reason for that is if this pulls full power out it's asking for 140 amps you cannot pull that much of power out it will melt all the cables so i need you to put the batteries online you can do it before you go to site and we'll put a new firmware on the batteries that will help protect that. Second level of protection when you are on site, put this online and then give us a call before you connect the batteries and we'll make sure that is also locked at 100 amps charge and discharge.